Everywhere you go, you can see the sights and sounds of the fall fair. We think it, we think it's one of the best we ever do. Of course, we think that every year, and we always try to we always try to push it up, push it up, push it up. Uh, you have to come and see some of the animals and the shows that we have. This morning, more than 30 floats rolled onto the streets in the annual parade to officially kick off the fair. What was your favorite float? We'll start with you, buddy. Uh, the Junior Canuck float. Why, why was that one your favorite? Because me and my dad and my brother always go to watch the games. Very cool. And which one was yours? The Junior Canucks. And why was that one? Because we go to watch the games all the time. <laughs> And do you have a different favorite one? Yes. Which one's your the favorite? The Dawson Creek Seals. The carnival was also being set up all week and was opened up this afternoon with several different rides. And what's, your, what's your favorite ride? Uh, the hurricane. Okay. Why is the hurricane your favorite? Because you go up and down. And you guys, were you guys pretty scared? Yeah, kind of. Apart from the carnival and parade, the stampede was also snatching up riding fans. On Thursday, the chuck wagons were racing in the stampede, and this afternoon, the bareback horse riders bucked into the grounds. But that's not all. Uh, we have all sorts of things happening over the weekend for children. We love kids at the fair, and they can come down and they can learn to rope. They, uh, uh, Secure is doing a barbecue for the kids on Saturday. Uh, we have a, a, a Miss Rodeo Canada is taking part and some face painting. The fair runs all weekend and has several different events for all you cowboys and cowgirls out there. Last night we were up about 15% over last year at the same time. So we're looking for, and today at Ranch Rodeo, it was a good crowd that was here today and so we're looking for we're looking to fill the stands uh, fill the stands tonight with only five years to go until the hundredth edition of the fair Patterson says the skies are the limit on what to expect in 2022 Eric Tashner CJDC TV News Dawson Creek